When it comes to life expectancy, Okinawa Prefecture and its semi-tropical islands off Japan's south coast have long been referenced as the benchmark location for living a long life. According to the WHO, the global trend for how long we live increased by more than six years over the first 20 years of the 21st century. But in Okinawa, that trend is in reverse. In 1980, it had the highest average life expectancy for both men and women, with men expected to live until at least 84 years and women averaging an amazing 90 years old. Yet, in the 2020 census, it was discovered Okinawan men were living to an average age of 80.27 years and women 87.44 years. Gerontologists have long attributed those long lives to a combination of nutritious diet, regular exercise, a continued sense of purpose, known as the concept of ikigai in Japan, and the vital support of close-knit families and wider communities. The people of Okinawa have been influenced by the food and lifestyle choices of other societies, particularly that of the United States. One of the downsides of globalization that clearly shows the impact of tourism and cultural exchange on indigenous communities. So, if Okinawa is now no longer the flagship for long living, where are the places and countries that people do live the longest? The not-so-simple answer is that it depends on which source you use, as reports conflict. But there are several countries and places that appear regularly toward the top of the list. So if you're looking to add a few more years to your life, perhaps you should consider heading to one of these five healthy hotspots. Welcome to another episode of Travel Time. Subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with the latest uploads. Let's get into today's video. Singapore Keeping the run of long-living Asia-centric, we find ourselves now in the sovereign island and city-state of Singapore, with an average life expectancy of just over 86 years, according to the CIA World Factbook. For Singaporeans, having access to excellent healthcare and, in particular, to the efforts put into early prevention and detection of chronic illness has led to a huge increase in life expectancy. It's risen by more than 20 years over the last 60 years. Singapore has among the lowest death rates for cardiovascular or chronic respiratory diseases, as well as for unsafe water or lack of hygiene. Road traffic mortalities are low, and amazingly, considering its urban density, air pollution levels are also comparatively low compared to other big cities around the world. Monaco the Principality of Monaco, tucked into a few coves of the Mediterranean Sea on France's sun-kissed south coast, may be the second smallest country in the world, but that hasn't hindered its inhabitants from thriving into their golden years. According to the CIA World Factbook, its average life expectancy is 89.52 years, the longest in the world, although again, that's not supported across multiple sources. Famed for its wealth, glamour, high-stakes gambling, and the most famous Grand Prix in Formula One, Monaco also gives its citizens a state-funded healthcare system, high-quality doctors, near-year-round sun and outdoor living, a healthy Mediterranean diet, and the kind of low-stress living that means you're likely to go on happier for longer. But in Monaco, it most definitely comes with a price tag most can't afford. Hong Kong the other commonly cited home to the longest living, Hong Kong is an administrative region of China and a booming metropolis of close to 8 million people. According to the World Population Review, which doesn't include Monaco in its ranking, it has the highest life expectancy in the world at nearly 88 years for women and 82 years for men, making the combined average around 85. It's a trend that's followed the city's rapid economic development since World War II, where it has developed a high-quality healthcare system that has resulted in one of the lowest infant mortality rates in the world. Mix in well-established youth involvement programs for education and employment, and it reflects that mantra of strong social bonds cited in Okinawa's historic long health. Add that seeming staple of long life, a clement subtropical climate, and you have a city bred for long living. Japan Despite Okinawa's drop down in the rankings, it still supports one of, if not the, healthiest countries on our list. 
Japan is home to the oldest man who has ever lived, in Jiro Emon Kimura (1897–2013), who reached the age of 116 years and 54 days. But not the oldest woman. For that, we'd have to turn to Jeanne Calmont of France, who was 122 years and 164 days old when she died in 1997. The same reasons we found in Okinawa are used to explain the long lives of citizens, the length and breadth of the country. A diet high in vegetables, seaweed and fish, lifestyles centered around family and community, and the pursuit of spiritual well-being through practices like Tai Chi, yoga, and even karate, described by many as training for the body, the mind, and the soul. Switzerland while the CIA may not agree, both World Population Review and Worldometers put Switzerland in their top five healthiest countries in terms of life expectancy. With an average life expectancy across both sexes of 84.25 years, Switzerland has nearly doubled what it was at the turn of the 20th century. The reason for this enormous increase can be directly attributed to the country's growing wealth and associative health benefits. Better preventative health care and access to doctors? A cultural predilection for exercise and healthy living, necessitated by all those mountains and lakes begging to be explored, no doubt, and a sense of general well-being. More spurious, perhaps, are claims that the national appreciation, and thus consumption, of lots of dairy products, including cheese, are behind its aging population. And with that, we've reached the end of this video. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more content just like this. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.